Hey YouTube, it's Gina. I'm just coming with an update video. I actually have not done an update video, I think, in a couple weeks. Just coming to see, um, to let everybody know how I'm doing. Everything is still going good. Um, last week was um, kind of a difficult week. Um, it was that time of the month, and it just makes it a little bit more um, of a struggle to get through the week. But I got through it. You know, I did... Um, I didn't do horrible with my food. I did indulge some and I didn't work out as much as I normally do. Um, I just get really fatigued and um, mostly fatigued and kind of irritable. I go through the mood swings and things like that. So um, I got back on it. I think I um, kind of got my energy back Saturday. No, Friday. Friday. Um, and I got a good workout in Friday, good workout on Saturday, good workout in on Sunday. So it's been um, a good week. It's been going well since then. Um, Food-wise, it's kind of been up and down. I am struggling so much with food right now. And it's not so much with craving. I've gotten um, really lazy on prepping. So that's been really the reason why food has been difficult for me. So um, I'm already doing some... Um, some researching to pre-prep um, for the upcoming week so I can do some grocery shopping. Not that I really need to, but I do for what I eat um, or what I want to eat. Um, really just the protein because I have um, a lot of the other things that I would need. As some of you know, I coupon. So through um, couponing, it just um, has made it um, I don't really have to shop as much because I have a lot of the things on hand that I need. Um, but like I said, I've been looking at some recipes. I've been looking at some videos on YouTube for recipe ideas. I've been on Pinterest. Um, I probably will also look on um, Instagram because I usually look there too for ideas. Um, I think I'm going to try to start cutting back on some carbs. I'm noticing that I'm just eating way too many and way too many bad carbs. So um, I'm back in indulging a lot in the chips. I'm having chips every day. Even if it's just a small bag, I'm having it every day. And I want to get away from that because um, I'm, I know that I'm addicted to eating chips. I always kind of have been. So, um, and it's causing me to indulge in other little snacks that I normally wouldn't even want. But it's I think it's all with the sugar craving. So I'm trying to get away from that and I'll probably... Um, just take a, just try to cut back on that altogether. Um, and I've done it before and been able to um, bring it back into my diet and not it not be a big deal. Me have it once a week or once every other week and it not be a big deal. Um, but I am trying to, um, I think I am going to do that, kind of cut back, especially on the bad carbs um, and focus on eating more nutritional um, carbohydrates. So, um, we'll see how that goes, um, going into the next week. Um, I'll probably go to the store this weekend to prep for the upcoming week, um, just to make it a little better. I've been doing some frozen entrees this week just for portion control, um, and just, um, because I didn't prep, so it just makes it a little easier. Um, so I've been doing that for this week. I still been working out. I kind of been just walk, walking and doing some weights, nothing really strenuous. I really, I, working out is not a big issue and it never really has been. I don't particularly love to work out, but it is not hard for me to do. It's not hard. Um, I have days where it might be hard for me to, to um, be motivated to do it. But it's something that I can get myself to do if it's even just a walk or something. The food is really where I need to concentrate because that's what is going to get me where I need to be healthy. Um, I do want to stay active, but I know food is just more important and I really need to focus on that. Um, I have gained quite a bit from my lowest weight. I'm actually closer to my pre-pregnancy weight for my second child. Um, so, yeah. Um I'm not happy with that. So going forward, um, I'm just going to be focusing on prepping, fo focusing on nutrition. 
I've been kind of staying off of, I, I'm always lurking on my social media, but I haven't been posting as much on it um, because I'm just trying to stay focused on what I need to be doing. Um, I haven't, I've been on my fitness pal, I've been on Instagram, I also have been on my Facebook, um, but I'm not posting. Um, so wait a minute, Miracle. I'm sorry. That's my door. Sorry about that, guys. That was my little one just trying to bust in on the video. Um, but like I was saying, basically I want to focus on, um, my nutrition. I'm making that my main goal. So that's going to be where I put out, concentrate all my focus right now. Excuse me. <clears throat> I will still... Um, work out, but I just won't make that like the greatest focus of this journey. I really want to focus on nutrition because I know that's going to be um, a big, big part to me getting healthy. So um, you can even see in my face, it's just, it's gotten bigger. It's just, yeah, I got to get some control back over this journey. So that's what I'm working on. That's what's been going on with me. I hope everybody's been doing great. Um, everything's been going great in the challenge that I'm in, the March to Good Health, I believe it's called. I can't even remember the name of the challenge, but um, that I'm in with Lovable Curves, Maxi, and it's been going great. Um, everybody in the group is just so positive and so encouraging and so supportive, and that's always the best part of being in a group. Um, when you're doing a challenge and um i'm like getting um kind of acquainted with people that i never really um talked to on any of my other social media so that's good too meeting some new people so um yeah everything's been going great and i pray that everybody has a great week um just stay focused on your goal and just keep pushing forward we can do this it you know, it's just going to take time, but we'll get it. We'll get there. So I will talk to everybody soon. Have a great week.